Hello, and welcome to the Writers and Illustrators of the Future podcast. This is John Goodwin, your host. Today's guest is Illustrators of the Future winner, Chin Jia Ma, otherwise known as Q. Welcome, Q. Thank you so much. So congratulations on being a winner. Thank you. It's my honor. Good. So uh, you you came in from where? Oh, I'm originally coming from China. I came here since I'm 18 years old. I came here for college. And then after college, I started working in the entertainment industry here in Los Angeles. Good. So where are you working now in Los Angeles? I'm working for Vanna Brothers Animation now. I'm working for the TV animation shows. That's awesome. Thank you. Congratulations. That, that must be quite a success for you. Uh, it's quite a journey. Yeah. So uh, how did you find out about Illustrators of the Future? Oh, I just trying to test out my um, illustration skills and I trying to just enter several um, competitions and just I just search for illustration competitions on Google and these things come up uh, with some uh, several different competitions. So I just applied. I wanted to see like how good I am. I, I, I don't have any expectations, but mm. I feel it's great that I, I win for the first quarter last year. Uh, it's really just surprised me. That's good. That's great. So um, have you always wanted to be an artist? Oh, I wanted to be an artist since I was really, really young. And uh, my mom's still telling me, oh, re you remember that I asked you, what do you want him to become after you grow up when you were six or oh, four years old? And you answered me, I want him to be an artist. So it's been all my life and all my journey is trying to be an artist. Oh, that's awesome. That's great. You've been able to stick to that and keep on growing with it. Yes. That's good. So anybody in particular that's influenced you in your journey? Uh, my mom is definitely my biggest supporter and my biggest influencer since she really, really supported me. Uh, as you know, I'm Asian and mm. uh, from China and then most of the parents there don't support their kids to become an artist. They want them to become lawyer or doctors. But my mom really supported me and she helped. Uh, I wanted to take art classes and she just supported me to go in to do all of that. And I wanted to go art and design schools for college and she supported me for that too. So definitely my biggest influencers and the biggest supporters. That's great. Will she be here for the event? Uh, maybe not. <laughs> oh. Yeah, but uh, she she will be really happy to see all this like podcast, or listen to this podcast, and then see the reviews. Good, and she'll also see the. It's we'll be broadcasting it live on. Oh, that on would the be internet. great. Yeah. that would be great. So be able to see if she's if she's not able to come. Cool. So, um, what are you most looking forward to uh, this week? Do you have any? I know you've got to work. Keep on doing work. Mm -hmm. So you're here today, and then you have to go back to work, and then you'll be back on Thursday. Yes, uh, I I just here. Um, first of all, definitely wanting to meet the writers since I haven't met the writers yet. The the story I've been doing the illustration is phenomenal, and I just wanting to meet these writers in person. And also, I wanting to meet other writers and uh, artists who ever also been that, and I know they definitely been through quite a journey in order mm -hmm. to get that. So that's the two things I'm definitely looking forward to meet them. Oh, that's yeah. great. And then tell me a little about the art that you submitted that you won with. Uh, that was actually my school project uh, back then when I was still in school. So I, I tried to uh, create some apocalyptic um, ruined world. Mm -hmm. And uh, I just used all my imagination. So I'm thinking about all this something uh, we will have since like chemical ruin entire world and then the things will be different so the plans will be different so I, I use my imaginations to do all that kind of illustrations and uh, I was surprised that that's actually wins the competitions well it's yeah. good it was it was very very good art thank you and then tell me a bit about the art that you uh, illustrated for the uh, the book uh it's based on the story it's also I, I think because of the illustration I submit and win is is kind of the ruin word and they also gave me a story based basically something similar is a, a apocalyptic and everything's ruined is 
extremely cold, and and I was just illustrating. And the funny thing is, the main character is Asian, so <laughs> and I'm Asian too. So I just illustrated a、uh, Asian guy, and then、um, um, and、uh, his partner is a white girl, and they are trying to. Uh, started their adventure out there, and it's extremely cold weather. So I was illustrated scenes based on before they start their adventure. That moment is my、right. key moment. Yes. Oh, good. That's、Thank、great.、You. So what do you like? Right now you're doing、um, working for you said Warner Brothers.、Mm-hmm. So what do you see as your future now as as an artist? Uh, I'm still trying to experiencing different industry now. Um, I've been working for comic and、uh, theme park de- design. Right now, I'm working for TV animation, and then I I still wanting to explore different things like explore like. Entering competitions is definitely is another experience.、Mm-hmm. Uh, doing the book covers, a、uh, illustration for stories is another experience. So, right now I still wanting to looking for continually grow my skill first,、sure. and then I tr- I, if there's opportunities, I want him to work for different industries like uh like movie industry maybe, oh、uh, like um. Future animations. So that's my goal for now. That's awesome. Thank you. Well, congratulations again on winning, and I very much look forward to seeing your career as it as it grows. Thank you so much. Nice meeting you, Q. Nice to meet you too. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thank you for listening. Stay tuned for our next installment of the Writers of the Future podcast. Subscribe to the Writers of the Future podcast wherever you get your podcasts. Writers and illustrators of the future are contests created by Elrond Hubbard to provide a means for the aspiring writer and artist to be seen and acknowledged. It is free to enter and open to new and amateur short story writers and artists of science fiction or fantasy. 